Good afternoon, Stephenville. I am multimedia editor Aaron Cooper here with your online on time update for Wednesday, April 14th. From the Tarleton Outdoors and the Antique Tractor Club and Pool in Stephenville City Park to the Native and Heirloom Plant Show at the Stephenville Museum, there are a slew of events happening in Stephenville this weekend, and the Empire Tribune has the scoop. Be sure to pick up a copy of Thursday's paper for the schedule of events. The Erath County Commissioner's Court approved a new set of guidelines Monday for family cemeteries. Find out what the new rules mean for residents tomorrow. It was Bonnie and Clyde meets Dumb and Dumber yesterday as one Deleon area husband and wife went on a crime spree in western Erath County. Find out how the chase ended tomorrow from staff writer Amanda Kimball. Look for all these stories and more in Thursday's edition of the Empire Tribune or online at EmpireTribune.com. And now, with 60 seconds of sports, here's sports editor Brad Keith. Sarah Fulfer and the Huckabee Lady Indians ran away with the District 20A Golf Championship and are advancing to next week's regional tournament in Nacogdoches. Also advancing to the 2A Regionals in Lubbock as an individual medalist is Dublin junior Jonathan Pringle. Read all about it in the Thursday edition of the Stephenville Empire Tribune. The District 84A Track and Field Championships are underway in Joshua. Varsity competitors began with discus, pole vault, and long jump this morning and will be running preliminary racing events this afternoon. More field events begin at 1.30 tomorrow, followed by running finals at 5.30. Lonnie Buchanan and Brandon Johnson return to the Tarleton State defensive backfield after earning all-conference honors last season. They talk about spring ball, the upcoming season, and head coach Kerry Fowler shares what he believes sets apart these special college athletes Thursday in sports. Stephenville senior basketball standout Brianna Bledsoe is committed to staying home and playing for Tarleton State University next season. Bledsoe will sign her letter of intent Thursday morning, and the Empire Tribune will have a full feature on the Hoop Star in the Sunday paper. That's a look at your sports update for today. I'm Brad Keith.